Welcome to this episode of the Business Revolutionary Club podcast. My name's Rob Yates and in this session what I want to talk to you about is capturing moments of inspiration and turning them into practical reality. This podcast is brought to you by the Business Revolutionary Club, our free business coaching membership service that has no catches, no credit cards and no commitments, just world-class free business coaching every 14 days. Now in these podcasts we set out to bring you immense amounts of value, ideas, motivation, inspiration, um, strategies, techniques and tools and I'm going to share one of those with you today as I drive to my client meeting. There is no fee for this, there is no payment for this, all we ask is that if you find value in this or, or you'd like more of this, that you go and join the Business Revolutionary Club at uh, just via the homepage of our website, uh, tetrakey.com. Um, and if you feel really, really generous, we'd encourage you to click like, subscribe to the podcast so you get notified when new episodes and new content becomes available. Uh, please write a review and tell us what you think, whether you love it or hate it. Let us know. We take your feedback immensely seriously. And um, share it with just one friend, just one person in your network who could do with a boost, who could do with a new idea, who could do with fresh content, something different to do. So let's go and talk about it. Um, capturing new ideas, new inspiration, turning it into executable stuff. Um, it's a critically important part of being a successful entrepreneur is creatively coming up with new strategies and new ideas for your business the entire time. Um, it's also the biggest downside of being an entrepreneur is that when you start doing it, you just can't stop. And um, <coughs> often these future-based ideas of I could or I can or one day I will get in the way of, um, of the today. And the today is critically important. The today of executing on the actions I need to take today to make today work but also to improve the business by just a small amount. In the knowledge that if I improve it by just a small amount every single day, the cumulative effect of that will be ginormous. And often what happens is we get caught. We get stuck between the not wanting to lose the great ideas we've had and, um, and also the needing to get on with today. We often become too future-based and that stops our progression because it stops us today. We waste time today. So here's a strategy I want to give you. I give this to, and I have given this to um, almost every client I have ever, ever worked with. Um, that ranges from CEOs and people who work at the very, very top of Fortune 500 businesses all the way down to um, one-man band, uh, self-employed entrepreneurs. And so you're going to have these great ideas um, yourself. And I had one this morning. I had an idea this morning that when I achieve a certain benchmark with Tetraki, will enable me to provide um, world-class delivery to you. Um, stuff that Harvard would charge you $2,000 a day for, um, or you'd pay Tony Robbins in excess of $1,000 for a weekend and a 10,000 person experience, um, where I'll be able to bring you that stuff for very little, for maybe $10 or $20, as opposed to $2,000. Um, and in doing so, it'll bring you massive value at a price I know you can afford, um, but also will bring um, immense riches to myself as well. It'll enable me to achieve my goals, my personal goals and my business goals. And so it'll tick two boxes at the same time. Now, this idea is genius. In fact, I got all excited about it over a cup of coffee about 10 minutes ago before I left the house. Started scribbling notes and then I had to hold myself accountable. You see, for me to be able to execute on this 
this idea, this moment of inspiration that will be game-changing and immensely disruptive for the coaching and business development, business growth, consulting world. In fact, it will disrupt it so much, I'll probably not have very many friends left at the end of it. Um, it's so exciting, yet I have to reach a couple of goals with, with the Business Revolutionary Club first to make it real. Um, I have to reach at least 10,000 members in one country. Um, and the second goal would be to reach 10,000 members in four countries. And, and you see, we're, we're a way away from that at this point in time. The biggest uh, membership number we have in a country is just over a thousand at this point in time. Um, and, uh, and so I've got to go and focus. And so this great idea, here's the thing that always worried me, is that, well, what do I do with the great idea? because I don't want to lose it. It's worth so much to you, um, it's so worth so much to me, and to lose it would be a crying shame. In fact, it would deny all of us of a great opportunity, you and me alike. And so I quickly shot off into my office with my spilling coffee out of the coffee cup, and I pulled out a brown envelope. Now it's a brown half size envelope, so A5 if you're in Europe or maybe Canada or South Africa, Australia, and sort of this envelope that's half the size of a legal piece of paper um, if you're in the US. And I wrote the idea on the outside of the envelope. So what I did, I wrote it down, the idea, how it would work, sketched it out, the numbers, um, what I need to achieve before it makes sense to execute on the idea. And I put it into my box. Now I've got in this box in excess of, ah, oh, I'm gonna guess, in excess of oh, 350 of those, those envelopes. They're categorised, so I've got a section in the box for Business Revolutionary Club, I've got a section in the box for Tetricky, I've got the section in the box for New Business Ideas. And here's what, so it's my brown envelope strategy. It's simple, it's practical. And then here's what I do, is twice a week I diary two hours, or schedule two hours out. And it's just, they're called brown envelope sessions. I go into the box, and I go and work out which brown envelope it is I'd like to work on now. Now this could take all and does take all sorts of shapes and sizes. So sometimes I found a, find a brown envelope that we're, we've hit the goals for it and it's time to execute it. So I pull it out and I use those two hours for executing it. On other occasions I, I get to the point where there's nothing that needs executing out of the brown envelopes or can be executed now from the brown envelopes. And so I, um, I pull out the one that is the most appealing or maybe most current, the, most, the one that's most likely to happen soonest. And I do some work on it. And that work takes all sorts of shapes and sizes. Sometimes that work is doing some research. Sometimes it's doing some business planning. Sometimes it's taking about all the slips of paper and pieces of paper that are in that envelope and just tied, typing them up and putting them all together and consolidating them. Um, there is no real right answer about how I use that time. Now, when I have an idea about the idea, and there's a fair chance today that I will have an idea about this uh, bringing you $2,000 worth of value for $20, or well, thereabouts idea. I scribble it on a piece of paper and I shove it inside of the brown envelope so I don't use it. And I keep doing that over and over and over again and then using my two hour slots um, a couple of times a week to go and make progress with those things. It means nothing ever gets lost and I'm always taking steps forwards with the ideas that I've had. So there we are, that's my simple, practical, cheap, affordable um, strategy that I use in all of my businesses um, to ensure that 
I don't ever lose ideas and inspiration, that I'm always capturing it, always growing stuff, and it clears my mind to allow me to work on what is today. What do I need to execute on today to make the business better tomorrow? What do I need to do that's above and beyond without having the concern or worry um, that, you, that you've lost something? You can use this strategy in your personal life as well, of course, because you can go and say, I've got all these concerns in my personal life, things, credit card bills, I don't know, whatever it might be, things that you need to get done. And of course, a great thing to go and do with that is put all those things on a list and put them to one side so you don't lose them and then allow you to concentrate on what's truly important. Because ladies and gentlemen, what's truly important today in terms of growing your business is probably the thing that will help you um, and ensure that you overcome all the concerns in your personal life as well. So that's it from me today. Um, I hope that's of some use to you about uh, working with the inspiration that you have, executing it, and a practical brown paper envelope um, strategy for you to go and use to ensure that uh, you never lose anything and you're always developing on, a, on, on something. And I give yourself those couple of hours a week. Uh, for me, it's four hours a week, but a couple of hours a week to keep working on it. Those things it, are important. And at some point in time, they will be needed to be executed. And by doing this, you'll be 15 million times further ahead. I'm going to go see a client now. If this is of value to you, please subscribe. Please share this podcast and introduce it to somebody you know who will get value from it. Please leave a review for this podcast. I read all the reviews personally and, um, and, and I action on them. Whether you like it, love it or hate it, whether you've got any advice, whether you've got a topic you'd like us to talk about, anything you like. Um, and of course, go and join the Business Revolutionary Club. Get free business coaching every 14 days why would you pay for something when you can have it for nothing to do that visit www.tetrakey.com and at the top of the home page you'll see a button that says free business coaching click on it and the rest will be easy no catches no credit cards and no commitments we take all of the risk so my name's rob yates it's been a pleasure serving you and i'd like to ask you to remember that you are a business revolutionary. I, 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 I,